Just like the street lights lit this town Like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down Can't be afraid to leave this out We got this far, don't know how
Good morning to all, ladies and gentlemen. Sri Durga Trophy, South Zone Cricket Tournament for Physically Challenged. From the age of 18 to 20 February 2023, with the international venue, KLCA Hooperley, Karnataka. Eminent skills, ladies and gentlemen, I, on behalf of All India Cricket Association for Physically Challenged, Karnataka State Cricket Association for Physically Challenged, and myself, Dr. I. M. Makuthai, with Gurmit, wish you a very warm good morning. To welcome you all, may I invite Shri Shivanand Gunja, the President of Karnataka State Cricket Association Physical Challenge and member for All India Cricket Association for Physical Challenge. Good morning friends, dignitary on the rise, after the rise. Welcome, Namaskar, aap sabko upreshet ke liye swagat, also swagat hai. Sorry for the delay, for unfortunately train was late. पहले कभी भी ऐसे होते थे, पहले प्लेयर आते थे, बाद में गेस्ट आते थे। लकी भी आप इतने लकी गेस्टर्स जो कमी कर ली। थैंक्स तू आल द डिमिनेटरीज, थैंक यू वेरी मच। वन एंड आउट, तो टाइम तो ज़्यादा नहीं लेंगा। आल द बेस्ट फॉर द टीम, बिकॉज़ यू आर प्लेइंग द स्टेट टीम, साउथ जोन टीम, � Thank you very much, sir, for your warm welcome for all the participants, the dignitaries and officials as well as the press and media present over here. Now it's time to invite Mr. Gurmit Singh, the member for tournament committee, for the guest introduction. Good morning, everyone. I heartily welcome you on behalf of Karnataka State. Cricket Association for Physically and Challenge Mubli for this Sri Durga Trophy. I would like to welcome Sri Viresh Mubli, Managing Director, Sri Durga Sports Academy and Sri Durga Developers and Promoters for this. I would like to welcome Sri Ashok Artis, the former MLA Mubli, who has been supporting cricket from past, past years at a regular basis. I would like to welcome Sri Vijay Sukar, Selection Committee member, yes, all India Cricket Association for Physically Challenged, and he is also son of Sri Ignat Sukar. I would like to welcome the youngest trainer of this zone, Sri Nikhil Pushar, for this function. I would like to welcome Sri S.C. Shetty. CEO of Profession, President of Sangam Uttar Karnataka, which has been supporting physically handicapped for recruitments for job opportunities. I would like to welcome, I think this man doesn't need any introduction, Sri Mala Bhushan, ex-terminator and the trustee of Daily Sports Foundation, and he has been one of the longest serving terminator for us and was promoted cricket at a very big level in this season, in this zone. I would like to welcome Sri Mani Jyoti Mahesh, Sri Sure Oswal, who is a cricket enthusiast, and Sri M.G. Arunga, qualified DCCI coach and also former women's coach for Karnataka. Thank you very much for your wonderful introduction, Mr. Gurkhek Singh. Now, it's time to present the mementos and roles to the guests of honor. First, may I call the team captain of the last year's runner-up, Mr. Suresh from Tamil Nadu, to come forward to present a memento address to Sri Viresh on the third, the managing director of the Dora Sports Academy and developers and promoters who will. May I request him to accept this as a token of love and regards. Thank you very much, Suresh. Thank you so much to think. May I invite the team captain of Goa, Mr. Shashank, to come forward to 
or backbone of this entire team along with the Buddha sir. I first congratulate both of them for uh, creating this event and making the sponsor as Buddha developers in the Indian interview here. And uh, myself, the section president of Uttar Karnataka, which is working for empowerment of the physical handicap, the physical challenge. So right from 16 districts of northern, northern part of Karnataka, our association works for the empowerment, the welfare, physical, the physical as well as uh, uh, economical, medical and uh, education. All these issues will take up and will try to empower as far as possible by our uh, institution. I wish this tournament a great success. You all play with the sporting spirit and I wish them, wish all the team a very good uh, future and try to win every match by every team. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, sir. We pray Almighty to settle you to work more for the betterment of human being on this globe. Now, may I request the instrumental of building this wonderful uh, stadium, the man who worked day and night, the former convener of Karnataka State Cricket Association for the Arbor Zone, the guiding torch, Sri Baba Bhutasar to bless you all. Good morning, friends. Hello, Namaskara. Sapro. Saprava. I just thought you go to make me die, sir. All the gentlemen with me on the dais. Off the dais. All the players who are submerged. Non playing staff and the staff. I welcome cordial. Welcome to you all, players from outside who have come to play and uh, I wish is that you enjoy the game and uh, this is a wonderful ground we have given to you last time. We, had, we, we didn't get the, this ground because of some uh, uh, bad years back. So this year we got a very good ground and we need to be, see better performances here. I hope you will uh, you'll all live up to that expectation. Is it? Yes, sir. You are going to put in uh, better performances. This is nothing else than a test ground. Okay, you can't get anything better than this in our test ground. What you see in the TV are not as good as this. So, I wish you all the best. And uh, my friend and uh, those associated with me in the last 20 years uh, who was instrumental of putting all these things up, Shivan and Major has taken. And it's been a lot of uh, support for putting this tournament together and uh, the ground also together. And, we all expect a good game from you, play to the healthy spirit, play to the goodwill, take back good memories, and Hubli should always be a place in your heart and you should be one thing to come back to Hubli again and again. That's our motto. We enjoy the game, we enjoy you seeing play. God bless you all. Take care. Thank you and thank you everybody. Thank you very much, sir. Now, I request Prejes Solkar, sir, the member of the selection committee, to say a few words. Thanks, thanks. Uh, good morning and a very warm welcome to all of you. Uh, it's always a pleasure coming to Hubli. Uh, I keep telling Shiva, you know, Hubli is my second home now. Uh, and this is my uh, I guess, uh, fourth visit. Yeah, fourth visit. And, 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 and the way uh, I, I want, on behalf of the ICAPC, I want to, you know, uh, best wishes to Sheva and his team, you know, for this tournament. Uh, best wishes to all the, you know, the teams participating and all the best to all the players. Thanks. Thank you very much, sir. Thanking you all for your precious presence and sharing from the distance. Pana hai jo wo mukham wo abhi baaki hai. Pana hai jo wo mukham wo abhi baaki hai. Abhi to aaye hain zameen par. आसमान की उड़ान अभी बाकी है अभी कम है ऐ लोगों में मेरा नाम अभी कम है ऐ लोगों में मेरा नाम इस नाम की पहचान बनाना अभी बाकी है सो इस टाइम फॉर नेशनल अंतम मे आई रिक्वेस्ट यू ऑल टू स्टैंड इन साउथ ऑन पोजिशन एंड रिस्पेक्ट नेशनल अंतम
जनगण मन अधिनायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विदाता पंजाब सिंध गुजरात मराठा द्राविड उच्चल बंगा हिंद हिमाचल यमुना गंगा उच्चल जल चितरंगा तब शुभ नामे जागे तब शुभ आशीष मागे गाहे तब जय गाता जन गण मंगल दायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विदाता जय हे जय हे जय हे जय 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 हे भारत भाग्य मोटो सी प्लेयर्स टेक दिस सेंटर स्टेज Let us all have fun, enjoy, and support this spectacular game called cricket discipline, and also pay respect to all the participating teams, officials, members, and the sponsors, and wishing all the participating team all the very best. Thank you, thank you very much. Good to you, Bhumi. So, not not wasting much time, I would request Karnataka and Andhra captains to please come to the centre. As officials, please. Other teams who have come late can please uh, complete their breakfast. Please, please breakfast. Yes. Yeah. Match officials, Mr. Praveen and Mr. Sahid Wajid. I request Andhra team, Captain. Kya the high cricket ki? Last one is Mr. Praveen. Kya chhe? Dusra kya chhe? Praveen. मिराज विराज Page to ball. Page to us. Part of winning the top. Andhra have elected to hey! first. So some some words in your Telugu. What you would have done? You would have. 
अंदर जाने का था और दीवान में उड़ेगा I request Andhra and Karnataka team to make it fast because we will be starting in 10 minutes. This is what I request, I request the first man, first man of Karna, 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 Karna,
I request Andhra, Andhra team commitment to please come near the commentator box.
हेलो कुछ को कैमेरा स्टार्ट कर हेलो So to start the proceedings for Andhra, it will be Venkataya, Venkataya who will be on strike. Another non second it will be Rahim Khan. It will be Jitendra from commentator box end to start the proceedings for Karnataka. Starts with the boundary there, nicely driven from Venkaya. Opens the account for Andhra with the boundary. And opens his personal account also with the boundary here. Tries to drive it there, completely misses it. Good comeback there from the bowler.
drives drives hard to the covers region nicely fielded there to cut completely misses it good come back there from the bowler three dot balls after getting hit for a boundary or at the very first ball there One more dot ball added there. Very well played there from Venkaya. That's completion of over number one there for Karnataka. After completion of over number one, score is four for loss of no wickets for Team Andhra. All India Cricket Association for physically handy, hand, physically challenged Mumbai presents Sri Durga Trophy, sponsored by Sri Durga Developers and Promoters. Shri Durga Sports Academy, Cartway Builders and Developers, organized by Karnataka State Cricket Association for Physically Challenged Hubli. In the first match, Andhra have won the toss and elected to field bat first. It will be Raheem Khan on strike now. It will be Rajesh from Railway End. To ball the second over of the match. On strike will be Raheem Khan for Andhra. Starts with a dot ball there, Rajesh. White signal from the umpire. Extra added to the total. Score moves on to five for Team Andhra. Clean him up there. First wicket falls in there for Andhra. Rajesh strikes in his very first over. Rain Khan, the batsman who was.
Raheem Khan didn't disturb the scorers much there. Going for the golden duck. Manikanta It will be Rajesh from Railway End and on strike will be Manikant facing his first ball of the match. One more dot there for Team Andhra. Wild signal from the umpire. Those two extra runs, score moves on to seven for Team Andhra, for loss of one wicket. Once one more wide there from the bowler. With that extra score moves on to eight. There has been a complete mix up there between the batsmen, resulting in a run out. Prime could not make it. Manik, Manikan could not make it there. Second wicket falls there for Andhra Pradesh in form of run out.
हेलो So it is a Andhra captain, Super Raidu walking in there now. Score for Andhra is eight runs for loss of two wickets. Appeal for LBW there, umpires not interested in it. Appeal for a court behind. Napaya seems to move there. Completely missed there by the wicketkeeper. Overthrow resulting into a boundary. Five runs added to the total. With that score moves on to 13 for loss of two wickets for Team Andhra. Cuts, cuts hard, e equally fielded well there in, in the point region from the fielder. Slow delivery there from the bowler, resulting into a dot ball.
After completion of three overs, score is 13 for loss of two wickets for Team Andhra. All India Cricket Association for Physically Challenged Mumbai presents Sri Durga Trophy. Sponsored by Sri Durga Developers and Promoters, Sri Durga Sports Academy, Cartway Builders and Developers. It will be Rajesh to continue from Railway End. And he starts up with a wide and keeper completely missing it. Five more runs added to the total. Score moves on to 18 now. One more wide there from Rajesh. One more extra added to the total. Score moves on to 19 now. On strike is Captain Subaraidu for Team Andhra. Cuts, cuts hard towards the covers region. Appeal for LBW there. Umpire remains unmoved. Cleaned him up. Rajesh backs his second wicket there. Bold the captain of Andhra Subaraidu. Third wicket falls in there for Team Andhra.
change the loading time. Change in bowling there from commentators and it will be Ramesh Singh. Shankar Singh, sorry. White signal there from the umpire. With that extra score moves on to 21, 22 sorry. Yes, appeal for a caught behind there, given by the umpire. Venkatiya falls in there. Wicket number four falls in for Andhra. Ramesh taking in. For Team Andhra is Saifullah.
Very well ball there from Ramit Singh. One more wicket falls in there for Team Andhra. This is wicket number five. Falling in form of Saifullah. Ramesh Singh striking twice in this over now. The next batsman walking in for Sri Mahandra is Tulsi Krishna. Shankar Singh has strike twice in this over now. Good bowling display here from Karnataka. They have already got half of Andhra's side now. A dot to end the over. After completion of five overs, score for Team Andhra is 22 for loss of five wickets. It will be Shankar Sajjan from Railway End to ball the sixth over of the match for Team Karnataka. On strike will be Naresh. Nicely tossed up there, resulting in a dot ball. Very well fielded there from the fielder in the long run region. With that, Naresh opens up his account. With that single score moves on to 23 for loss of 5 wickets.
very well ball there from Shankar. And he has been stamped here. Wicket number six falls in there for Team Andhra. Good sense of wicket keeping there from the wicket keeper. Shankar Sajjan gets his first wicket. Score now reads. 23 for the loss of 6 wickets for Team Andhra. The next batsman walking in for Team Andhra is Praveen Kumar. Karnataka have kept things tight here for Team Andhra. Good display of bowling there from Karnataka here. In the first match of Shridurga Trophy. Presented to you by All India Cricket Association for Physically Challenged Mumbai. Sponsored by Shridurga Developers and Promoters. Shridurga Sports Academy. <laughs> Physically challenged Hubli. In the first match, Andhra won the toss and elected to bat first. Till now, the decision has not gone into their favor here. They have lost six wickets. For a score of 23 runs. It will be Pramir Kumar on strike. A slight piece of misfielding there from the fielder in the fine leg region, resulting into a single. Score moves on to 24 for loss of six wickets. It will be Shankar Singh to continue from commentator sent. Who bought a beautiful first over, bagging two wickets in that over.
This is very good polling display from Shankar Singh. White signal from the umpire. Score moves on to 25 now. Just a single there towards the long on region. With that single score moves on to 26 for loss of 6 wickets. 7th over in progress. Wicket number seven has fallen here for Team Andhra. Third wicket there for Shankar Singh. The next batsman walking in for Team Andhra is Purushottam. This is complete batting collapse here from Team Andhra. It will be Shankar Sachin to continue from railway end, bowling 8th over of the match.
Slightly misfielded there from the long off region fielder. Appeal for a LBW there, umpires look unmoved. Bat involved there. Very well balled there from Shankar Sajjan. There was a chance of catch there. The fielder could not reach it. After completion of 8 overs, score is 29 for loss of 7 wickets for Team Andhra. Batsman batting in is Purushottam and Praveen Kumar. It will be Shankar Singh once again from commentator sent. The ball is 3rd over and ninth over of the match. On strike will be Praveen Kumar. Wild signal there from the umpire. Score moves on to 30 with that extra. Appeal there for LBW. Umpire is not inter interested in. That single score moves on to 31 for Team Andhra for loss of 7 wickets. Shankar Singh bowling is third over, already back 3 wickets. One more appeal there for Amp and given LBW there. 
Purushottam is the batsman who got out. Fourth wicket this for Shankar Singh. Eighth wicket falls in for Team Andhra for the loss of eight wicket score is 31. The next batsman walking in for Team Andhra is Nagraj. This is some great bowling from Shankar Singh who is into his third over, already backed four wickets and just given away six runs with an economy of 2.40. He has been equally supported by Shankar Sajjan from the other end, who bowled two overs, given away five runs and taken one wicket. Three balls, three balls. Completion of 9 overs, score is 31 for loss of 8, wi eight wickets for Team Andhra. Change in bowling from railway end, it will be Krishnappa.
sweet sweet away nicely there ball racing away to the boundary a much needed boundary here for team andhra nagaraj opening his account score moves on to 36 now for team andhra one more misfield there ball races away to the boundary two boundaries in a row now for nagaraju score moves on to 40 with a single score moves on to 41 for team andhra for the loss of 8 wickets nagarajo moves on to 9 pravin kumar batting on 7 after completion of 10 overs score is 41 for loss of 8 wickets for team andhra it will be shankar singh from commentator send to ball shankar singh will be bowling as fourth over he has already taken four wickets can he take a fiver here one more dot ball there from shankar singh appeal for lbw and given shankar singh backs his fifth wicket now first fiver of this tournament nagaraju falls in there wicket number 9 falls in for team andhra at the score of 41 first five wicket haul from shankar singh in this sri durga trophy
The last batsman walking in for Team Andhra is Jeevan. Wild signal from the umpire. Score moves on to 42. <laughs> and that's it. Innings for Andhra comes to an end with the fall of wicket number 10 there. Shankar Singh bagging sixth wicket now. Target set for Karnataka is 43. This is, this is great bowling display from Shankar Singh in the first match of Sri Durga Trophy. Very well bowled. Good bowling display there from Shankar Singh. At this certain age,
top bowler for Karnataka, Shankar Singh, 3.4 overs, 7 runs, tagging 6 wickets. Supported well by Rajesh Kannur, who bowled 2 overs, gave away 10 runs, took 2 wickets. And Shankar Sajjan, 2 overs, 5 runs, 1 wicket. Just like the street lights lit this town Like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down Can't be afraid to leave this out We got this far, don't know how
Right now, we have a chase now. Team Andhra are walking in as well as the match officials. Team Karnataka have a score of 43 to chase down in 20 overs. It will be Nayan Shinde and Manjuna Jagla for Karnataka will be opening the batting. It will be Captain Subaraidu to start the proceedings here for Team Andhra from commentator descent. On strike, Manjunath Jalgar. Starts off with a wide there. Karnataka opened their account with that extra. Cuts, cuts hard towards the deep point region. Just a single. Manjuna Jalgar opens his account. It will be Nain Shinde, the wicket keeper of Karnataka on strike now. Just a mix up there between the two batsmen, taking use of that misfield. Nain Shinde opens his account with that single. Score moves on to three. Karnataka is chasing a target of 43 set by Andhra. Cuts, cuts hard and ball races away to the boundary. Score moves on to seven.
मुझे ना जालगा रीजन स्ट्राइक ओ ही हिट्स हार्ड एंड इट्स गोस फॉर बाउंड्री फोर रन्स फॉर टीम कर्नाटका Nicely hit there from Anjuna Jalgar towards the mid-wicket region. Ball racing away to the boundary. Score moves on to 11. It's hard towards the covers region. No run added there. Just a single there to end the over. Score moves on to 12 for Team Karnataka now. It will be Venkataya from railway end to ball the second over of the match for Team Andhra. Manjuna Jalgar will be on strike. Very well balled there. From Venkataya. Giving due respect to the bowler from Manjunath. Nicely hit there from Manjunath towards the final leg region. Ball racing away to the boundary, third boundary for Team Karnataka. Score moves on to 16. They are in hurry to chase this modest total of 43 set by Andhra. Manjana Jalgar batting on 14 from 7 deliveries with the help of 3 boundaries at a strike rate of 200. Wide signal from the umpire with that extra score moves on to 17 now. Over number 2 in progress. One more wide there. It's hard, up in the air, field underneath it, just away from the fielder, ball racing away to the boundary, fourth boundary for Manjuna Jalgar, score moves on to 22 for Team Karnataka. With that boundary, he moves on to 18 now. Drives well, drives hard, 
it will race away to the boundary. Fifth boundary for Manjana Chalgar here. Score moves on to 26 now for Team Karnataka. One more there from Anjuna Jalga. This will again race away to the boundary. Score moves on to 30. They just need 13 more runs. And I think Manjuna Jalga is hungry for the lunch as well as for runs. Manjuna Jalga playing a five innings here. Moves to 26 from 10 deliveries at a strike rate of 260. Chance of a run out there, but missed from the keeper. With that single score moves on to 31. After completion of two overs, score is 31 for loss of no wickets for Team Karnataka. They need 12 more runs to win this match. Change in bowling from commentator's end. It will be Naresh to bowl the third over of the match. Manjunath Jalgar will be on strike. He's playing on 27 from 11 deliveries with six boundaries. Very well played there from Manjunath, respecting the bowler. Up high towards the long run. This will race away to the boundary. Seventh boundary for Manjunath Jalgar. Score moves on to 35 now. He moves on to 31. Karnataka just need eight more runs now to win this match. This is five innings from Anjuna Jalgar. Drive states to the bowler. He's batting on 31 from 14 deliveries, seven boundaries. Charges up, drives straight. Very well fielded there from the fielder in the long run region. Showing some football skills. Just a single. Score moves on to 36 for Team Karnataka. Seven more runs required now for Team Karnataka to win this match. Cleaned him up. First wicket falls in here in form of Nayan Shinde. 
He has been cleaned up at the score of one run. Karnataka losing up their first wicket. The next batsman walking in for Karnataka is Krishnappa. Sorry, it's Om. This is change in bowling from railway and for Andhra. It will be Purushottam. Two more runs added to the total of Karnataka. Score moves on to 38. They just need five more runs to complete the formalities here and win this match. Manjunath Jalgar batting on 34 from 16 deliveries. Cuts, cuts hard. A misfield there. This will race away to the boundary. Boundary number eight for Manjuna Jalgar. Score moves on to 40, 42 now. They just need one more run to wrap up the things here. Seventeen balls, thirty-eight runs for Manjuna Jalgar. That's it. He finishes off in a style with the boundary. That's an easy win there for Team Karnataka in this first match of Sri Durga Trophy. Manjunath Jalgar single-handedly winning them this match. Scoring 42 runs from 18 deliveries at a strike rate of 233 with help of nine boundaries. They have chased this total in 3.3 overs. So after lunch, we will be having the second match of this tournament between Tamil Nadu and Goa.